Damn, that's fucked up. I ain't have a blunt road. Nope. <laughs> I was gonna say it, but it'll happen as that's we commence. <clears throat> good, cool. Welcome back. Welcome ah, back. I'm from Woosa. Woosa. You know what I'm saying? Woosa. Woosa. You've been sitting here for like two hours now. Both of us had to calm down. Today was not the day. <clears throat> Got the do right <clears throat> flapping up. You understand you know what me? Saying? But welcome back. Welcome back. To your favorite podcast, the Don Corn D Week and Hippie Show. We are your hosts. Don fucking call. And the highest hippie in the room, D Week and Hippie, of course, is episode 196. So we back at it. What's going on, Cole? Oh, man, same shit, man. Um, I can't even say same shit. <laughs> it's a Richter scale today, but I'm I'm balanced. Yeah. I'm balanced. I'm chilling. Um, won't disclose too much. I'll just say, like, you know, the world goes round and round, man. Life is doing this thing right now. Life is lifing. You know, and it goes, it rotates very. Lifing? 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 Life is lifing. It's lifing. You know what I'm saying? I guess. You got lifers out here. You know what I mean? So the lifers is lifing. They've been through this shit two, three, four times. Yeah, man. (laughs) So, you know, I've been in a good, I guess, um, uh, space. I've been in a good room. I'm lucky. I'm just trying to hang Bing Bucks. Clean up. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I've been good. I had my experience today with the uh, COVID test. They put the stick up the nose. Tear up. I was like, <laughs> nigga. She nigga said, you crying? You I said, nah. Hit you back here. And I said, be- nah, you look good, but. <laughs> when they did it, I told you my shit was a little congested. I seen that shit. I said, yo, she give said, me a second. Oh. Let me blow my nose. Nigga said, no, no, no. I said, no. She had to push through, is it? No, no, I blew my yeah. fucking nose. Nigga said, nah, I'm not. You know me. I don't play that, that shit. shit. <laughs> don't have me fuck all y'all up in this office. Y'all not built for this shit that I will. We saving your life. Listen, and I'm going to take yours. I'm going to take yours by reflex. Just give me a second. Let me relax and blow my nose. Let's see how long that Q tip is. It's bugging me out. Pause. So let me blow my nose. Yeah. My shit not. That's not what, I, cause I, you know, I seen we seen them before. It's just like when it gets done to when you. It's I was you. Like, oh, shit, when it's for you. When it's for you. Hit me right here. That shit be like, bop, bop. Oh. But you know, <laughs> it be like this now. How much you gonna get? Humbly beat, humbly, humbly beat COVID this time. You know what I'm saying? Past that. You know what I mean? Humbly, you gotta stay humble with it, cause you know, never know when that bitch gonna creep up on you and be like, yo, what up? I'm almost two years in. You know what yeah, I'm saying? You, I'll gotta, with it. you gotta stay humble with it, cause that bitch will pull up on you and be like, what's good? You was talking crazy. Yo, yeah, shout, shout out, out to, shout out the public school free lunch. I still eat cheese its Fuck you talking about? Mm-hmm. School free lunch yeah. was the shit back you in know back know. in that late nineties, early nineties. When 90s? they brought cheese its in the school. <laughs> The bagel, the, the mini bagels with the cream cheese, that was my mm. shit right there. The mini bagels. I used to be like, yo, give me like six of them. With the chocolate milk? Mm. Oh my God. It's getting mm. crazy. High but, school, I never got on, on on the lunch line, but I always had two trays of french fries. Yeah, taking niggas tickets. Yo, mm. you know what to get me. <laughs> you know what I did? You know, I was always scheming. I found the niggas that just wanted pause, niggas just ate sandwiches or the murder burgers. Yeah, I'm like, yo, yeah. boy, give me a fries. Give me your fries, yeah. That's like when we used to be together and you used to eat pizza. This nigga ain't never eat the crust. crust. like, whoa, 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 you not throwing that out? What you doing, bro? <laughs> right there, right there. <laughs> Pass that yeah, along this slices, way. Yeah. And I just finished eating two slices myself with the crust. Two slices? Yeah. <laughs> nigga got two crusts right there. Just make sure when they get right there, you rip it and give me the crust. Boom, we good. <laughs> this much. Right I don't there. know what the fuck was wrong with me. I, I wasn't eating the crust. What was wrong? I don't know. You ain't like bread like that back in the day. Yeah, I wasn't feeling that. But I, I guess all that weed had me like, hmm. <laughs> Dip this shit in salt. But where we gonna start, man? We gonna start, we can start with start the whole Olympics? You like. Oh. <laughs> What's going on? Everybody, bow, viral. <laughs> Niggas is going viral. Niggas like, grr, bow. <laughs> let's talk about the good. No, let's talk about the great first. Bro that rode the whole bunt, made it to the top, came down. They was like, yo, give him the lighter. Give him the lighter so he can spark it when he hit. Did you see the poise? <laughs> the poise? Did you see the poise? Gold medal, oh my god. Like, oh, hold on. Look, he not stuck up there. He not stuck. 
He just finished rolling the blunt. He looked down. He like, just rolling the blunt. He like, oh y'all, nah, I'm, I'm, I'm good. I'm good. <laughs> I just want to like this. Y'all got it like? <laughs> Step right down. Go shit. Ah, you um, know what I'm saying? You that shit when you get done. Shout out, shout out to the crate challenge. I'm going to tell you this. Uh, the, good, the good, the bad, the flaws, the amazing uh, footage that we're getting. And, don't, um, man, don't mind the lighting neither. You know what I'm saying? And shout out to all the... Um, hold on. Shout out to all the new subscribers. Yes. All of y'all. Yes. <laughs> I really appreciate it. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to everybody that's been leaving comments, hitting that like button. Uh, this summer, we've been getting a lot of love on this podcast. That's you know what I'm saying? And me and Cole was just talking about it behind the scenes. We were saying this summer was kind of like slow, like personal love. Mm -hmm. But for us with this podcast, like it's been making its steps. You know what I'm saying? So shout out to it's everybody, man. You know what I mean? It's been we fuck with y'all. You know what I'm saying? Yes, 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 love, love is love. <clears throat> Like, share, subscribe, comment. You know what I'm saying? Like, share, comment. I did it backwards. Yeah, because I always do it backwards. You fuck me up. LCS, <laughs> man. Like, we in the chip. Um, mm -hmm. Well, I'm talking about the crates. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, the good, the bad, the ugly. You know, everything with it. And I, I, I just want to tell people, like, stop, stop always trying to kill the fun. Stop. Oh, yeah, stack crates together, but you won't stack bread. Oh, together. Together. That's the main part, y'all. Y'all come off ignorant of shit off together. Of <laughs> see niggas fall and break their they necks. And somebody died though, and somebody did die. Yeah. I did. Somebody For real, yeah. yeah. Somebody, yeah. Had somebody died. Somebody died. Because I mean, the way they falling is real unexpected. So you don't know how you gonna fall. They got people on each side trying to catch you, but you don't know what you gonna do when you fall. <laughs> Shout out to the um, everywhere that's. Acknowledgeable to the fact that you know you're falling at least six plus feet in the air, and we should do this on like grass, you know. But then we have the Brooklyn uh, New fellows, New East New York, Crown Heights, Brownsville. Listen, man, asphalt. Yeah, niggas niggas is on the tall, in the man. Of the street, bro. <laughs> in the middle of the street. It's lit though. You know how we throw out here? It's the yeah, concrete it's jungle. We ain't going in the park to do this shit. We're going to line it up right on the curb. Pay the crackhead. <clears throat> That's what I see a lot of too. And I mean, it's dope, man. You seen the one in Coney Island? With the cop? Mm, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. But you seen Son did it with the hookah though. Mm hmm. I saw Son with the hookah. Son said, I'm going to go up there with the hookah. If you going to go, you going to go? He said, If you going to go, I'm going to go up there with the hookah. Top five is the dude with the bunt. Uh huh. That one. Uh huh. Shorty that did it with the heels. With the heels. She clear heels. Clear heels. She um, nigga said she looked like she was walking in the 2022. You know what I mean? Little man, was it a, a boy or a girl? They was young though that did it at Boosie spot and got that 200. Yeah. He crossed it. Oh, cro man. Yeah. But there was a lot of ugly too. I mean, shout out to 309, man. We take shit to another level. They lined them shits up and was like, yo, jump over them. <laughs> they had that shit stacked all the way up. Niggas was trying to jump over it in the um, football, in the, uh, in the grass. Brooklyn always trying to find the superheroes. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, the superheroes is out here. We just, we don't give a fuck about saving lives. You know what I'm saying? America but is the crazy. crate, the crate challenge is, crate challenge. Thing. I don't know who started it. I don't know where it came from. I know when I first seen it was with the Spanish dude when he fell on his face. He was all the way at the top. That shit started shaking like they do. I started seeing it for the first time on. Uh, I saw Snoop promoting a lot of it, putting a lot of it on his face. He was putting the crazy ones, bro. You seen yeah. the one when Shorty kicked the crates? <laughs> Nigga made it to the middle one. I'm tired of this you shit. You know that was Brooklyn, That's bro. Fuck. You know that was Brooklyn, bro. <laughs> And he said, yo, I hate that old nigga, bro. <laughs> if he do that shit, I'm kicking. That's some shit I would have did, bro. I probably did that shit to James, bro. I ain't even going to hold you. He just tried to get out there. I'd have been like, son, this is it. Shawn Michaels kicking the shit out these crates as soon as he get up there. And he was going to fall anyway, but fuck it. Let's make it worse. That's crazy. But I, I like it, man. It's just dope to see the milk crates having another use again. Cause you know I'm, what I'm I, listen, man. We used to use them for basketball, basketball hoops. Remember, we used to like you. It was a a, a certain milk crate. 
Like it was either the, the wide circle or the when you got the rectangle the one. one. Yeah, the blue ones. Yeah, but the remember the ones. little small ones? It was like, nah, we don't want them shit. Those but mad the, hard to shoot. Shooter, you can't get it. That shit hit the stop. <laughs> Only Joseph made those shots. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he only made those shots. Yo, you go to our old block, you still see the, uh, the backboard on the um. That shit not coming down. Shout out to Kike, man. Yeah, he used the super duper drill back in the days. He said, "Yo, step back." You remember why though? Said, oh. You remember why he did that? I kind of have a remembrance, but I don't remember why. Was it for his daughters or some shit like that? No, oh, for us. It was more so for them. You got to remember, this is a time when we're kids, so we're just looking from a kid's point of view. We continuously bang that fucking board and different boards into that tree. Nails and shit. Where was we getting all that shit from, bro? Oh, no. We was wild. <laughs> and Ir- so Irv made the backboard. Irv made the backboard made the at the lumberyard. Lumber and, and then they- we was trying to put it up, but it was paused. It was too thick. Yeah. Geeke came and he yeah, pulled up. Down. He came down with the boom bop. Black and yellow jaw. That shit was, was like, oh. bigger than him, bro. And it ain't got no wire. He was like, nah. Mm. Air compression. I'm about to go crazy. On That's it. like 9-8. Nine, 9-9, nine, nine, bro. That shit, he came down with no call for that shit. I thought he was going <laughs> to boom me. First of all. I know I've been talking to your daughter, bro. Through the window and all that, man. You know what I'm saying? But I'm a kid, bro. But he came up, he bop, 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 bop. That boy mm-hmm. not coming down unless that tree come down, bro. Yep. Yep. So and then we used to just put a fucking different crate because I used to dunk on it so somebody dunk and so you dunk all peanut you dunk that shit just the front would come off mm-hmm. and we gotta pull the shit off that was fun that was yeah crazy. man so to see the milk crate have a use and that wasn't just our block that was everywhere nah that was everywhere <coughs> I don't know how many I, in different states too mm-hmm. I don't know you know what I mean because we wasn't and we got in America. Yeah. Cool. And then with the garbage cans was the shit. We, we have full coats on garbage cans and a flower pile. And then the crates used, for, well, they, then we started using the crates to sit down yeah. until the cops was like, yo, you can't, can't sit, sit on, on the crate. What? <laughs> but if I bring out a beach chair, I'm good. Whatever. Remember, that's when um, everybody on the block started buying chairs. I got a cup hold on my shit, nigga. Then we started putting the chairs in the street. They was like, oh, we got to get up. We can't out this. We can't do nothing. Damn. But yeah, shout out to the crates, man. Shout out to the milk you know crate, man. Shout out to the digging in the crates. milk crate, man. Just shout out to digging in the crates. Digging in the motherfucking crates, man. <laughs> yeah, that's they was used for that, too, you man. Know, everybody out music. there with bruised limbs, sternums, and chest plates. Because I seen some, I, I seen some, I seen some doozies. I seen it. I seen it fall forward, <laughs> and the, the crate hit him right here. Yeah. Now we've dealt with milk crates, like we said. <sighs> Them shits don't like don't. for you. They're not gonna bend. Yeah, that part of the of the crate, like the square part. That shit those is, shits is thick. Those parts is. <clears throat> the other parts cool. You know that's why I could push in and shit. Yeah. That but that ain't moving head. nowhere neither. But them edges, mm. I see the fall on right on their back. Ah. <laughs> nice skin shorty with the glasses almost broke her neck. Yeah, she fell on her head and did the full flip. I said, "Oh my god!" I showed Tay. Tay was like, "Nah, I can't." Now what I'm gonna say is, some of these people should know the crates. Like some of the great setups I see that I'm like, nah, see these these are not even the same crates. <laughs> these ain't even the same this ain't Crosdale. You putting them shits on top of they already shaking. So, nah, I need sturdies. I need sturdies. I might be able to. Especially if we in the grass. Yeah, niggas ste- nigga stepping on the middle of the crate, you wildin'. You gotta try to find your balance. You gotta edges, edges. You gotta diagonal. Yeah, yeah. yeah see, you know. Yeah. <coughs> Shorty put her heel right here. Yep. And covered the rest of the mm-hmm. way. You know what I'm saying? And she just kept going. And like they said, whoever was recording, she said, "You did it faster with the heels on." So she probably did it with her shoes on, with her regular sneakers on. She was like, "I'm doing that shit with the heels." Black girl magic. You know what I'm saying? Black but shout magic. out to the crate, man. The crate and the um paper brown paper bag, most un- most underrated Listen, objects in brown paper bag. 
Shout out to the brown paper bag. Brown paper bag. Yo, shout out to that uh, subscriber and uh, supporter that thought I was in diapers in 96. I just thought that yeah, was crazy. Yeah, good looking, bro. Shout out to my youthful look. You know what I'm saying? I'm 80s, baby, though. Strong and proud. <laughs> Talking about subscribers, OnlyFans. <laughs> <laughs> Holding me down this last month. <laughs> um, I've never subscribed to OnlyFans. No, no, no. no I've I've seen like um, you know, sometimes people be like, it's it's Labor Day free. <laughs> they be making this shit free for the day. I'll be I like, see it. oh, hey, let me go check. Let me see if it was free. You did. Oh, okay. Okay. Oh, it ain't free no more. All right. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> but uh, OnlyFans is moving in a different direction for whatever reason. I don't know if it's crazy to me. Oh, I do know. But um, away from sexually explicit, sexually content. explicit content. And a lot of people are confused on why because so much money is being um, produced and made. You know, they take 20%. Now, they done made millionaires over the past year, and a lot of thousandaires, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. In the hundred thousands, you know? So they taking 20% off all these people, plus the small motherfuckers, right? So they've been cleaning up. Mm -hmm. OnlyFans been cleaning up, and they've been, you know, producing uh, entrepreneurs, in a sense, <coughs> which is dope. But uh, what happened is the uh, banks are pulling away. So MasterCard and Visa, Said this clip, we're not gonna take payment from you to let this female or male or male to let the to let the because we do on there too doing their thing. Yeah, we're not going to school to school that we're yeah. just doing their thing. Yeah, so that's crazy. As far as getting money, it's a lot of people getting money. Pause that. Mm. For all y'all <coughs> weirdos out there. Yeah, there's niggas out there that's definitely on OnlyFans doing their thing. Like so, um, Master and Visa was like, we not doing it. Which is crazy to me because I'm pretty sure Master and Visa doesn't mind taking it from... Pornhub? No, they got rid of Pornhub. Okay. But, yeah. um, but um, Pornhub is paying. But I just mean from adult content... And, you can't tell me Master, MasterCard and Visa doesn't accept no payments from any yeah. platform that has, has some type of sexual explicit content, violent content, any type of, you know what I'm saying? Because I could go pay for... I pay for HBO Max and watch Suicide Squad. Yeah. Then I could watch Rick and Morty that has a cartoon that is basically having all that. All, all of that, everything. But then it's cool. So then it's cool to like subscribe to like a um, a regular dating app to get somebody to who's do also, sexually explicit who's, content. Who's also on there? Not everyone, but also advertising. I'm single. I'm ready or, to mingle. Or, or, or I, you know, you pay and hook up. Yeah, pay for hook up or whatever the case is. You know what I'm saying? Don't even advertise it. As soon as you start talking to them, they'll be like, "Yo, listen." If you really trying to fuck tonight, all right, just give me a buck fifty and you will fuck with Exactly. You know what I'm saying? So. Shout out to P. Easy Battle just dropped versus Foster Boss. That's what I was going to say. So, like, what's, like, crazy? Like, I don't know if I'm saying, like, what's more right or wrong. You know what I'm saying? I'm just saying, which one is more, like, I don't know. What, it's, like, picking, it's picking and choosing, bro. It's the women that's showing their shit on there, right? For I think money. Wrong right. or are the people that's on regular dating sites that's looking for a man, right? And maybe something happens when you doing something physical with somebody, you know what I'm saying? Other than you could just be showing your shit on camera and nigga really paying you, you know what I'm saying? And nothing gonna happen to you physically or you know what I mean? I don't know. Um I understand how you how you how look I'm trying at, to how you trying to look it, right? at it. I think it's bigger than that though. Yeah. I think, I, think bigger bigger than than too, yeah. I think it's bigger than that. I think it's bigger than that. I think it's the competition that probably been involved. You know, I always go to drug deals and shit like that. Like I'm watching Godfather Harlem right now. So bumpy 
in a sense. You already know all this shit. He took the connect from the Italians, the, mm-hmm. the French connection. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But he, they've been fucking with the Italians for so long. But, but at the same time, French connection, like, yo, you know what I'm saying? You my guys, then you bugging out. He, he over there bugging. I'm gonna fuck with y'all because this is the business we've been doing. And I look at it like that where all these other forms where they probably do take payment for adult content and sexually explicit content is like, nah, they, they killing us right now. You know what I mean? Not only are they killing us, but they're making independent artists in this forum that are able to take and create their own fans, just like YouTube, right? Just like streaming. The labels ain't like that shit at first because they ain't know how to adjust to it. It's the same thing. Yeah, you're not you taking... Because you, you was telling these, me what to do. Right, and now these, these women that, that probably thought about performing these acts or doing this doesn't have to come to these... Um, um, Sanctioned porn uh, uh, production companies. Mm-hmm. They doing it from their home. Mm-hmm. And they're picking and choosing who they want to sleep with. Creators. They're content creators instead of just performers and entertainers or mm-hmm. adult stars. They're content creators. You're directing, you're producing, all that. And yet, you're, you're, you're the star. Yeah. Who do you need? Nobody. So when they get upset and they see that shit happen, they losing money, bro. Not only losing money, but they losing talent. Yeah. Nah, we gotta get this right. Master and Visa pulls out. That's crazy. But I don't know, so there's like other platforms and shit where Not like OnlyFans. I see Tiger um Talking about he trying to start a website, right? Yeah. Um let me see, I got it right here. Mm-hmm. Tiger has deleted his OnlyFans to start his own platform, MyStar, which will allow its creators to post sexually explicit imagery. The platform, which is set to debut in October, will only take 10% from creators' earnings as opposed to OnlyFans, which takes 20%. Mm. Um, my only question with that is, what form of payment are you taking? More than likely, it's gonna be like PayPal or some shit like that. Have to be Cash App. Yeah. Because PayPal is always. What you need it? Not sure. In the kitchen? No, we don't got it. Yeah. They don't have to be like Cash App or PayPal, they're third parties. They'll be mad. But the banks are gonna be upset because even. If I'm expe- accepting it from like a uh, Zelle or some shit, nigga. I That's could just bank. take it from you. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? We could just pay each other. I don't even have to name it that anymore. Mm, Zelle is different. It's just straight to the Because you could, you, could, you could have memberships through PayPal. You yeah. understand what I'm saying? So they could set it up like that. Because that's Cause the PayPal third, is more of a credit. Thing. That's the third party. And then it takes from your actual right. wherever you mm-hmm. And just like Cash App as well, <clears throat> which I I don't know. I think, I think people could start doing that soon because Cash Apps give you, they got cards now. Well, all this blockchain and everything is coming they into got cards fruition now. too. So, yeah. so I'm pretty sure. I pay with my Bitcoin. However. And Bitcoin, and, and you <laughs> well, can buy Bitcoin on on Cash App. But yeah, well, whatever. There's so many forms of payment now, right? That you could that eventually the authentication. Yeah. But I don't know if be able to you be able to avoid that wall. But that's this is like um like the thing that we see with Disney where they try to keep everything clean mm-hmm. inside their shit. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's almost like that. This is run. <clears throat> Only fans is Instagram. Instagram is Facebook. Facebook is Mark Zuckerberg. O- only, only fans is the the Indian that went over there. Yeah, they tried to test it out to see what was going to happen. They ain't know it was going to take off like this. Now you clip this, and but I. It's, it's just like any other social media thing where you like, where you the creator, you create it, and you like. I think this is where I wanted to go. People that have businesses on Instagram. My only fans that's really interested in me, you could pay for something exclusive shit. You know what I'm saying? Joe Button's podcast, exclusive Patreon. episodes. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, shit like that. So 
Because it's porn shared on Patreon. Yeah, so then certain people that go into it like, oh, let me see what I could, if I could cross this line. Yeah. If I could cross this line. If I Then eventually it gets to what it is right now, you know what I'm saying, where it's almost, it's a virtual strip club. <laughs> where you could walk in there and be like, oh, I want to see this, I want to see this, and I'll pay for that. Three dollars, bitch? <laughs> and, and direct link, like, straight to her OnlyFans. Yeah, you know what I mean? So I don't know, but I don't know. Shout out to all the creators out there that, you know, always find new ways to do new things. You know what I mean? Shout out to OnlyFans, man. Shout out to OnlyFans, man. You know what I mean? I ain't gonna knock that. They had school teachers. They had everybody getting money last year. You know what I'm saying? I ain't, I can't hold you if I ain't have kids and I I'd have been I'd have started my own shit. I'd have been showing my abs on some D'Angelo <clears> shit, <throat> thrashing <laughs> shit. All right, look at this. Look at these moves. COVID masked up, my mom. Mad mad role play type shit. That shit would have been does, crazy. Does Joe Biden get a shout out for? Canceling 5.8 billion in student loan debt for over 300,000 people with severe disabilities. Does he get a shout out to that? No, he's the president. They supposed to be doing shit like this already, right? Yeah. Very much shout out to that. Well, man. Hopefully, they keep going step by step to people without disabilities, people with families that still is in debt to college and they're not even working in that field you know what i'm saying because <clears throat> he was supposed to be clearing um people's uh student loans mm -hmm. if i remember correct that was one of his yeah i don't know if that's happened you know disability i mean that's cool but great you're the president i don't my I'm, blood pressure is good Blood pressure. Shout out to moms getting me the early B day Style. gift. You know what I'm saying? Juice. You know what I mean? <laughs> but yeah, um, I don't have no shout outs for that, man. Let me see where we going with this. You saw the uh, trailer? Spider Man. Yeah. What you think about that? I damn near cried. <laughs> and I feel like, uh, what's the name of it, Spider Man? Mm, no home. home. No, no way home. No, no way, way home. home. Yeah. He fucking with Doctor Strange. Huh? Okay. She about to get crazy, huh? Boy. December. <laughs> yeah. Um. I damn near shed a fucking tear, and I feel like either you know. Or you don't know. Like, that's it. And if you know, you was like, oh, they doing that. Mm -hmm. They really doing that. Mm -hmm. And I didn't have to see the other Spider-Mans. Yeah, they about to do the Spider-Verse. Yeah. And, Toby, and just to Toby see. Toby McGuire going to be in there as Peter he, Parker. Uh, and, and Boy from Facebook. But to see Doc Ock come some, out. Uh, Garfield, I forget his first name. Yeah, see, Doc, I come out. What? And um, the Goblin's bomb. Same what? Man. I said, oh. Same man. Same man. I ain't see that. <laughs> it's about to get good. This how they should have did it. Same man was out there too. Nah, it's about to get crazy. It's about to get crazy. So, um, did you see the preview to Carnage? Oh yeah, 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 yeah. That shit yeah, look yeah, hard, bro. Yeah, yeah, that shit look yeah, hard, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That shit look yeah. hard, bro. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that shit mm -hmm. look tough. I ain't mm -hmm. gonna lie. But I like how they tried to do that little teaser um, trailer mm -hmm. because when Doc I come out, that's a whole totally different scene. I, he's like, "Hey, Peter," and it turns out, um, you know, boy, Spider Man now, and mm -hmm. put the suit on. That's, listen, that's not who the fuck he was talking to. I'm not dumb. <laughs> that's not who he was talking to. He was talking to his student. This shit is crazy. It's about to get crazy, bro. Yeah, shit you got Dr. Strange crazy. out there fucking shit up. What you doing, boy? Shit is about to get wild. But, um, what's going on with, um, R. Kelly's trial? 
nastiness. Shit up the block, right? It happened. Shit down the block. Happening down the block. Yeah, shit down the block. Shit right around the corner. Shit happening right now. I don't know why they brung him here. They always bring that. That's the main shit. Why though? Because it's Brooklyn, bro. I just don't understand why. Cause I gotta look that up. Maybe because they had the realest gangsters over here and they had to <clears throat> build the spot to be like, yo, listen, everybody from around the world, you get locked up on some crazy shit, your trial is over here. I'm bringing you to Brooklyn. Going right in that basement, you're gonna be like, oh, you're taking me to the basement? No, we going underground. And then when you get up, you're gonna be like, oh, how am I in a prison cell? <laughs> <laughs> You don't never go outside. Yeah, but that shit is getting crazy, man. They bringing everything up on R. Kelly. You know what I'm saying? He about to go down. Um, His jail sentence ain't nothing but a number. Shit. <laughs> it ain't nothing but a number, right, nigga? They gonna give you 66. Man, they said um, he married Aaliyah. Uh, I'm... And that's what I don't like about this shit, that she gets dragged through this Like he, he, for a reason? Yeah, and she, wow. so she could get an abortion. Like, she was pregnant by him? Uh, I, don't, I don't know, but, no, I don't know that, but I'm possibly. Or was she pregnant by somebody else and he was like, yo, for you to continue your music? But I don't, no, that's not what's being, you know how court is and lawyers, that's not what's being, that's not why that's being said. Mm -hmm. It's being said because, you know, that's why he married this underage girl. Cause yeah. She was already pregnant. Mm -hmm. So, and they said there was uh, male victims. Oh shit. He had male victims too? That's what the girls are saying? Like. That's what the court is saying, bro. That's well, yeah, they got all their, they did all their background and everything, yeah. right? They asked everybody questions and all that, so. This is when they bring out what they everything. got. Everything. Yeah. Everything. Everything. What more? It's nasty. Me. <laughs> it's nasty. I, I, listen, anybody out here after this shit still like, I don't care. I'm, I'm still stepping in the name of love. You out of your fucking Skadoodle, nigga. Yeah, because that's what we were saying. We was like, a nigga, really, a musical genius really got some fire, but damn, like. That nigga just, wrote that whole, and that's, that's what I'm saying. Aaliyah, <clears throat> Aaliyah music just drops, right? You look at AJ number, the num number. That's the name of the fucking album. I already know this, you know, but this is for people who might not know. Then he all the way in the back. All the way in the back, right? Like, just, like scow, cow, scour, like, right? He wrote every fucking track. And that whole album is very sexual. The love I give to you will never change. Age ain't nothing but a number, and a nine ain't nothing but a thing. What? I can't. Damn. That shit make me cringe, bro. Fuck. Stop. He wrote that shit for her. <laughs> so the trial is nasty. He's a nasty man. He should be locked away and stoned. Lock him away. Throw away the kid. I told you. Remember, now that you've been around me forever, I thought it was crazy when he was calling himself the Pie Piper. And I looked that up, and I was like, yo, y'all know who Pop Piper is? That boy went around. Wow. <laughs> Shit is crazy, bro. So, I just think that a lot of people should be locked up. I think a lot of these kids or children at the time, parents, should be locked up. I feel like his manager and all of his enablers that was around should face penalties too. Cause if we run in a criminal enterprise and you paying him out as such, right? He had people that was dead and allowed him. Yeah, he had to have people that was helping him. Right. He wasn't doing he wasn't all this so. these, you know, he wasn't, they was bringing these people to him. It's, it's crazy, bro. 
It's crazy. Yeah, because even if so, even if you pass that part, he got other people living in his home that's not a part of none of that shit and seeing this and not saying nothing. Until they put in a fucking documentary. Chefs, like, cooks, cleaners, you know what I'm saying? Shit like that. And I said it. I ain't watched that shit, but I'm like, shouldn't some of these people face penalty to you? They are admitting guilt on this show. <clears throat> yeah. If I'm moving bricks of fucking heroin, you know what I'm saying? In about a week, and niggas getting hit off and reaping the benefits of this shit, you going to jail too, nigga. Mm hmm. <clears throat> These are children Y'all allowed this shit to happen I just think He shouldn't be the only one That faces The fucking bullet bro mm -hmm. But he should Face a firing squad I don't care Yeah yeah You know he gone he Gone We ain't gonna hear about R. Kelly no more After this trial It's just how it goes They build you up To bring it down Like touches mate <laughs> What you call it? Turning in his grave. Who? Basketball player. Basketball player. From Chicago that got shot. So that was gonna be the Ben grave. Wilson? Wow. That's his man. Who? R. Kelly. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. That was one of the best 30 for thirties, bro. Ben Wilson? That shit made me cry, bro. This nigga was the truth. That shit made me cry, bro. Shout out to Ben Wilson, man. Rest in peace, yeah? Rest in peace to Ben Well, man. Police officer that killed uh, George, uh, Eric Gardner was fired. He's out of there. <laughs> Get him out of here. What year was that? Because I was at the ferry. 09? 10? Nah, it was like... 13? Like 11, 12. Yeah, uh, by yeah, you would. I can't breathe for these, right? Yeah. The heat. Yeah, so that was like 11, 12, some shit like that, yeah. Yeah, man. 10 years later. Rest in peace to Eric Garner, you know what I'm saying? Um, I don't really got nothing else. You got anything else? Watching, Who's better? Watch, wait, you watching Little League World Series or you ain't filming it this shit? I don't got cable. Oh. Um. <laughs> it's been nice, it's been cool. Ain't been no um, crowd in the stadium. Who's, who's in? Who's in the championship? It's like the double elimination now. I'm not too sure because I fell asleep on the games last night. I, I'm not think Jersey laws. It's still a few. It's still going on. I saw some little. I ain't seen no international shit some though. Some little Italian kid. He was I don't high. think it's no international. Oh what? Nah, bro. Oh, because of COVID. So it's just, it's just, I, I like it like that. I actually do. Not that I. For the championships? Bro, period, bro. For Little League World mm -hmm. Series, I like But it that's like how that. they do it, though. No, I just, I don't want to see it. I don't you don't want, play don't international want. during the Little League World Series until you get to the championship. The, the, bro, the Little League World Series is going on right now. Yeah. There's no international Little League World Series going on. No Carousel versus Thailand, none of that shit. See this. And I don't mind. That's what I'm telling you, bro. It, it actually, to me, if I don't, I don't want to sound. Like, I don't care about the international teams, bro. I don't care when Finland comes over here, Denmark. I don't give a fuck, bro. I want to know who's gonna win here. Who little niggas here? That's all I really be caring about. I don't care about Japan always going to the chips. So yeah, we know it's them or Chinese Taipei. Come on, bro. Like it's whack. Leave them niggas where they at. No offense, respectfully. <laughs> Yeah, I was saying, I don't got nothing else. You got they had a female, the 20th female in the Little League World Series this year. She was nice. I can't remember her name. Nah, but oh, yeah, who's better? Hmm. Let's get into We're going to get into sports. Miguel Cabrera or Albert Pujols? Miggy. Ooh. Don't play with me. And don't argue neither. That's crazy. Miggy. I'm fucking with Miguel Cabrera, too. But I don't think it's... Conclusive. Niggs. Yeah. Why are you saying it like that? Because it's easy. How? Bro. Well, he won. How many, what? How many championships he got? Who? Huh? Who? Huh? Who? Cabrera. One. One? Yeah. He was there in Florida? In Florida. That's where he got his chip at. That's it? Only chip he got. But Al Pujols only got one, too. 
That's why I'm comparing him. He won his on the Marlins. He won his on the Marlins. Who better hit it, bro? You tell me. Me. I don't know. I do. Oh, you forgetting about the machine? I ain't forgetting about shit. You forgetting about Man, the machine? I'm thinking of only. I'm only thinking about. Come here, boy. I'm only thinking about that, bro. I ain't thinking about it. Oh no, but it's like neck and neck for me with them two. And you know that's prime shit. Where I was, we was watching baseball, baseball, watching baseball. How many triple crowns I ain't got? I was full host none. How many boy got? Girl Camara got, I think two. <laughs> <laughs> that's why I just let you go. I was full host still got more hits and more home runs though. I mean, tri- I mean, triple cr- I mean, triple crown. I better batting average. I mean, triple crowns your boy got. Yeah, yeah, but they both got World Series rings. How many triple <laughs> crowns your boy got? Yeah, that's that's batting average, home run, and RBIs leading the whole league for a whole season. Two, he got two, and my son. How many niggas do that? <clears throat> He's only the seventh Hispanic to do it. Shit is crazy. Miggy, bro. And he fuck niggas up, bro. And he not pussy. I'm going with Miggy, bro. I think he's a um better fielder. Son, he don't even like boy because he nice. Who? I think he really fuck with him, but like on the field, he like nah. But um, oh, it's the Japanese kid, Otani. Oh, Cabrera. Yeah. Cabrera don't fuck with him. You, bro. You gotta look at their interactions, bro. <laughs> you can YouTube that shit and I bet you they got a full clip of it, bro. I don't have to look he be fucking with him, like, even when he get, because you know he play first, so if he get on, he be fucking with him when he on the plate, when he pitching to him, all that shit. Coming off the field, he be grilling him. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah, Mickey don't like him. On the field, he don't like him, but he probably give him respect off the field, you know what I'm saying? But, you know, he probably on some shit like, who the fuck is he? He hitting 40 home runs. He getting 20 win? All right, let's see. Hold on. You looking at it? No, nah, I'm looking at his stats right now. His career stats. Piggy? 2,957 hits. So he's going to be 3,000 this year. Mm-hmm. 501 home runs. He just hit 500 this year. 311 batting average career. 267. 1,499 runs. He's about to have 1,500 runs scored. RBIs, he's about to have 1,800, roof. 40 stolen bases for his career. You know, that's what it Still is. Still for what? Yeah. I'm on here on runs. My slugging in 534 career. Mm, you sound like a, a, a play on a show. <laughs> <laughs> well, <laughs> this my, this be my numbers on a show. All right, let's see. Albert Pujols is batting 267. Career? Yep. Yeah, that's my guess. 297. I was close. Fire. I was close. Dang, that's three hits off. <laughs> that's three, four, probably yeah. five hits, you know? Uh, 3,295 at bats. I mean, hits. Hits? 3,000? 677 home runs. Yeah, 677. 600. Nigga, we was talking about him going to be the greatest home run hit of all time, but then he started getting hurt. Uh, happens, right? 2,145 RBIs. That's it? With 677 home runs? 116 stolen bases for the guard, nigga. <laughs> Slugging, 544. They comparable. Fuck that. Fuck that. He And he got two World Series. Because, yeah, he got two World Series. I ain't say they wasn't, year, I ain't say they wasn't comparable. I mean triple crowns, your man, God. I feel you. That's the separation for me, right? You take it, you take it, Cabrera. I'm taking Pujols. Fuck that. <laughs> it's because you racist, bro. They both, they both Caribbean. <laughs> they both from wherever they from. <laughs> I think they both Dominican, aren't they? Uh, I think so. I don't know. They both great, though. They yes, both they are. legends. I'm yeah. going with Miggy, though. Yeah, I feel you. They both legends. I, I love Miggy because when he was young in Florida, he was bugging he was bugging out for this. He helped stupid, beat the Yankees, bro. you know what I'm saying? The Marlins is stupid, bro. Uh, I think we got a couple minutes. Um, Boston to retire KG's number five. And he's still mad at Ray Allen. <laughs> he deserved that, though. Who, Ray? No. Who, KG? KG? For his Retired, and retired in Boston. Celtics. 
He was there for three years. No, they years. probably just want to put more black names up in the Raptors. <laughs> to be honest. But no, he doesn't deserve that. He should be retired in Minnesota. That's his home. Yeah. He's out. Listen, I would even tell him, like, yo, respectfully, thank you. I appreciate it, but I'm good. The number 21, right? In Minnesota, right? Yeah. You got to retire. Right? But I'm good. Don't even retire me in Boston. Well, I was here, four years? Okay. So. But that be me. So LeBron should. Only have his jersey retired in Cleveland. Should he have? I'm should he have it retired in Miami? Yo, I don't know. I'm asking you. Yo, I swear. I'm asking you because you know how you know how I, feel. I really be trying to like this nigga. This is my <laughs> man, but y'all niggas be making it. Y'all niggas make it and difficult, the bro. Nah. Y'all niggas make it difficult. Y'all want statues everywhere too, right? <laughs> Fucking ridiculous. In the street, man. <laughs> what, LeBron way. LeBron's way. <laughs> and I know it's artists out there that enjoy. Listen, man, it should only go down in Cleveland because they actually still love him there. He should it's get not the like jersey the, and the statue. It's not like the Cleveland. first time when he left and they were heartbroken and burnt their jerseys. I was he out there. They the actually chair. still love that man there. He took That's it. where he should be retiring at. I don't care if he go anywhere else after this. One day contract, signed there. That's your right. that's your home. You gave yeah, them, yeah, yeah. you gave them what they haven't had in fucking fifty something years, almost sixty. Come on, you know what I'm saying? What are we talking about? Yeah. You gonna retire in, in Dade County, in Wade County? Stop it. So where Ray Allen getting his jersey retired? I don't know. Which one you want? Well, I don't know. Seattle. I don't know. Ain't no Seattle. Milwaukee. Boston or Miami? Which one? It's not gonna be in Boston, bro. Miami? He gotta get his jersey retired somewhere, right? He he doesn't have to. I mean, somebody's retiring his. He jersey. doesn't have. We talking about Ray Allen, bro. Top five. I know, but we talking about Ray. We talking about Ray. That nigga be like, yo. Sorry. <laughs> Got three chips. <laughs> you know who I am. <laughs> Jesus shadows were stop fucking playing with me, all right? Bobby Bobby so, Bobby Bobby who? Bobby Bobby, 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 Bobby who? Oh, Bobby Bowden? Yeah, Florida State. I always thought he was racist, but uh um, He was him. a great coach. <laughs> rest him, really. but I Cuz you can tell like by the bro, teeth, bro, the yellow bro, teeth and the eyes. <laughs> it's the crazy racist eyes, bro. Wait, what's from the NBA, the old nigga. Oh, oh. <laughs> the, 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 the old nigga. Oh, fuck. Will be Brown? Stink ass, bro. Will you be who? Him? Racist coffee. I'm going to tell you right now. I'm going to tell you right now. Dude. Look at his. Look at his. Look at his, his, ca- his calves. <laughs> Stronger than they were last year. Why are you why are you surveying this black man like a specimen? Like he's on the he's on the slave he's trade, like he's on the block. He's standing, he's like, look at that. Gotta have him plowing the fucking fields all day. That nigga crazy, bro. But That's what you talking about? Yeah, yeah. Give me brown? Yeah. He got one of them faces, like he was Stink racist. breath nigga. But um yeah, I remember Bobby Bobby, yeah, about it, but you easy. could not tell me. <laughs> nope. Reggie Bush not getting his um, Heisman back. Yo, Reggie Bush is in Wendy's commercials, and I'm not understanding why. I know it's for college football, but they could have went and got Vince Young. Where the fuck is Vince Young? I don't know, but where was Reggie Bush? Reggie Bush is on TV every fucking day. I don't watch that shit. I mean, he's on sports TV every day. On what, Fox? On ESPN. With them stupid ass suits, right? I don't really like his commentary too much. He's not getting his Heisman back? It's like clock. I don't like You're not getting his Heisman back? It's fucked up. He was killing that year. He was trash in the NFL too. (sighs) I think he had a good career. He got a chip. His numbers is decent, bro. He wasn't what he was in college. I understand what you're saying by that, but... You see my boy though. Who? My boy is official, right? Who? My boy is official, right? The challenge. The second episode. I watched it. You watched it. He eliminated. What's his name? Oh. Ed. Ed. It's my guy right there. Got boy about it. 
<laughs> no, I have one. Yeah, he won. He ain't got the black dude about it. Yeah, right, bro. It's all right. I'll see you next year, you know what I mean? Whatever. That's why I don't be wanting to go on the challenge, because it's not, you know. Yeah, nigga, you're not eliminating me the first episode. Nigga getting beat up. Charging that shit. TJ go back to <laughs> Charging that shit, nigga. So, something you try to play me. Oh, man. Yeah. Um, you got anything else you want to give to the people? Um, nah, I think, I think that's... Yo, man, make sure y'all save the date, September 4th. September 4th. You know what I'm saying? The smoking section event, you know what I mean? We got some dope artists on the on the menu, on the schedule, you know what I'm saying? It's going to be real crazy that night, I'm not going to lie. Um, shout out to Math, you know what I'm saying? Shout out to everybody at S Street Media that's making this happen. Mm -hmm. um, but besides that, uh, I don't got nothing else to give to the people. This episode is going to be a straight episode. I might not put no clips up because I'm going to be out. Oh, happy birthday to you know my brother, Notch, a.k.a. d Rican Hippie. You know what I'm saying, man? Another fucking lap around the sun. You know what I mean? We out here crushing man. it. You know what I mean? Still out here looking young and shit. Yeah, man. Facts. I think I got like two more years of looking young, though. Yeah, me too. Shit is getting Because I think the stress of the past two years will catch me in two more years. Shit is getting critical out here, yeah. Yeah, but I'm going to get happy soon. Fuck that. <laughs> so for that being said, for Dog Cool, it's D-Rika Hippie, and y'all already know what we're about to do. We're about to get up out of here. Okay.